Welcome to 50 Seconds in Franchising with Houndstown President Rob Flanagan. Rob, what is Houndstown? So Houndstown is a premier doggy daycare and boarding facility. Uh, it was founded by Mike Gould, who was one of the leading uh, people of the New York City K-9 unit. And he's just one of those amazing, magical humans that he gets dogs. And he understands how dogs think and see the world. And he took that philosophy and then put it into a doggy daycare and boarding concept. And what really are your key differentiators? Everything that differentiates Houndstown drives from our dog management approach. Our tagline is, we do it for the dogs, and we really mean it. How much is the total investment typically required, and how does that compare to competitors? Yeah, so within our item seven, our high end is about 750K, give or take. Uh, compared to our competitors, we're a much cheaper all-in cost to come in. What drives that, again, is our dog management approach. We're not building things into our facilities that humans think dogs need. We're building everything to what the dog needs. And how fast are you growing? So our growth, we are really ensuring that we're growing and we're excited about that, but we're not doing it in a way where we get over our skis. Uh, today, we're at 50 units. We should be around 60 by the end of the year. And next year, we should be between 80 and 90. What I like to stress for Houndstown is that what really drives us as a franchise is the average unit volume and unit economics of our locations. That's really our main KPI. What will investors find in your item 19? Houndstown is incredibly proud of our item 19. It is as transparent as you can make it. Not only do we have the standard sales comparisons year over year, but we put in the P&L statements of all of our locations within the reporting group. So any prospect can take a look at all those uh, P&L statements to make the best decision for them. If you look at our current FDD, I want to say there's 19 different PL statements in there. If you enjoyed the discussion, please see the full episode on our YouTube channel or Spotify podcast links below.